Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. Bold and the Beautiful. Finn a disgrace, Steffi branded a killer. Bold and the Beautiful has Finn shocking everyone he encounters next week, as his behavior towards Steffi Forrester is incomprehensible on the CBS soap. Steffi stabbed his mother to death. This is something John Finnegan can't wrap his head around but at the same time he's missing the boat big time on his husbandly duties, so it looks like his attitude and behavior might help brand his wife a killer. Finn disgusted Steffi Forrester, Jacqueline Massins Wood, by leaving her when he heard the police coming. Even her father, Ridge Forrester, Thorsten K., caught the uncaring husband act that Finn displayed. It has to be upsetting for John Finnegan, Tanner Novlan, to hear his mother died, but she was in the house to kill his wife. What Steffi Forrester went through was horrific. She was terrorized by Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, in her own home. Then she also took a life. Despite this person being a monster, she still ended someone's life. That alone would weigh heavy on anyone, even though those around her say Sheila deserved what she got. While many bold and the beautiful characters support her, she finds out next week that some will not. So repercussions seem to be around every corner next week for the Forrester daughter. But instead of support from a caring husband, John Finnegan turns angry. Finn looks at his wife as if she shouldn't have done this. Next week, he tells her he needs some time to deal with the enormity of this horrific event. She's not only hurt but also angry over her husband's reaction, so bold and the beautiful tainted Finn big time for the fans last week, especially in the scene with the police on their way. That's when his wife really needed him, but he ran away. Maybe Finn always thought that someday things would calm down and Sheila would prove herself a changed woman. He cried while revealing his pain over never getting to know her now that Steffi killed her. When Ridge showed up at his daughter's house the second time, he was peeved that Finn wasn't there with his wife, but the police were there and Lieutenant Baker, Dan Martin, didn't show much empathy toward the Forrester daughter after her horrendous ordeal. So, next week on Bold and Beautiful, this top cop is not about to leave a distraught Steffi alone. While Baker questioned Steffi Forrester, Finn found a shoulder to cry on across town. Hope Logan, Annika Noel, showed up at her dad and Sheila's apartment. She was there to tell Deacon Sharp, Seen Cannon, about Sheila's death, but Finn had beaten her to it. After hearing the devastating news, her dad left so the two were alone. It seems like Bold and the Beautiful use the time between Hope and Finn to share John Finnegan's mindset. Finn can't get past Steffi killing his mother. It looks like that marriage made in heaven has a rocky path ahead. If Finn doesn't snap out of it, a complete demise of their marriage could be in the cards. Steffi Forrester soon has the opportunity to experience what Sheila Carter felt like when she was shunned as a murderer. While Steffi defended herself by stabbing her mother-in-law, that's not how some people will take this starting with her husband. It appears Lieutenant Baker continues with his lack of empathy next week. His line of questioning suggests he thinks there's more to this stabbing than Steffi lets on. The police not finding a weapon on her mother-in-law doesn't help matters much. Plus, Elt Baker likely gets wind of Steffi saying she couldn't live without fear until Sheila was dead, and Finn might be the one to share that with the police. Then Deacon is also aware of what Steffi Forrester said about wanting Sheila Carter dead. Plus, he knows that she punched her mother-in-law in the face, so it's likely Steffi won't be seen as someone favorable by Deacon, considering she killed the woman he loves. Because the Foresters are such a high-profile family, news of this killing likely gets around fast. Steffi Forrester might find herself surrounded by people whispering at work and in public. This wasn't just a cut-and-dry self-defense stabbing. She killed John Finnegan's mother, the woman who gave birth to her husband, so she likely gets a taste of what it was like to walk in Sheila's shoes after some people brand this mom of two a killer. For bold and the beautiful fans, the writing is on the wall. So what's happening to Steffi? One thing that's happening is Hope Logan. She's likely soon a problem in the Forrester daughter's marriage. She's on Finn's side. So unless Finn wakes up and supports Steffi Forrester, it's just a matter of time before B and B starts to rock their marriage boat. Maybe even to the point of sinking it on the CBS soap. In the opulent world of Los Angeles elite, where beauty, power, and deceit collide, scandal is always lurking just beneath the surface. And in the hallowed halls of Forrester creations, where fashion reigns supreme, drama never sleeps.
the latest saga to rock the foundation of the renowned fashion dynasty involves none other than Dr. John Finnegan, affectionately known as Finn, and the stunning Steffi Forrester. It all began with whispers, mere murmurs among the privileged few who frequented the city's most exclusive haunts. But soon those whispers turned into fervent gossip, spreading like wildfire through the tight-knit social circles of Beverly Hills. Finn, the dashing doctor who captured the heart of Steffi Forrester, was now at the center of a scandal that threatened to tarnish his once sterling reputation. The whispers grew louder, fueled by speculation and innuendo. Whispers of infidelity, betrayal, and deception. Whispers that painted Finn as a man of questionable character, unworthy of the love and trust bestowed upon him by Steffi, the radiant heiress of the Forrester dynasty. But amidst the swirling rumors and accusations, Steffi remained steadfast in her defense of Finn. She refused to entertain the notion that the man she loved could be capable of such transgressions. For Steffi, Finn was not just a lover but a beacon of light in a world shrouded in darkness, and she was determined to stand by his side, no matter the cost. Meanwhile, the Forrester family found themselves embroiled in a battle for control of their beloved fashion empire. With tensions running high and loyalties tested, alliances were forged and broken in the blink of an eye, and in the midst of it all, Steffi found herself at odds with her own family, torn between her unwavering loyalty to Finn and her allegiance to the Forrester name. As the scandal continued to unravel, new revelations came to light, casting doubt on everything Steffi thought she knew about the man she loved. Dark secrets emerged from Finn's past, Secrets that threatened to destroy not only their relationship, but the very fabric of the Forrester family itself. But Steffi refused to back down, determined to uncover the truth no matter the cost. And as she delved deeper into Finn's mysterious past, she soon realized that the man she loved was not who he appeared to be. Behind the charming facade lay a tangled web of lies and deceit, a web that threatened to ensnare them both in its deadly embrace. As the truth finally came to light, Steffi found herself faced with an impossible choice. To stand by Finn, despite his betrayals, or to walk away and salvage what remained of her shattered heart. And as she grappled with her decision, she found herself branded a killer in the court of public opinion, judged not by her actions, but by the sins of the man she loved. But Steffi refused to be defined by the whispers and rumors that threatened to consume her. She refused to let the sins of the past dictate her future. And as she stood tall in the face of adversity, she realized that true strength lies not in the perfection of one's character, but in the courage to confront the darkness within. And so, with her head held high and her heart ablaze with determination, Steffi forged ahead, ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead. For in the world of the bold and the beautiful, where passion and betrayal reign supreme, true love will always find a way to prevail.